Coach, big road win. Your thoughts after this win here at Dick's Sporting Goods Park? Well, <clears throat> we message the guys is that, you know, we, we had actually had won four out of the last five coming here. We lost in early in 2016, but we've had some results here. And our team had a challenge sometimes believing they could win. So I wanted to give them some belief that they could win. We gave them a game plan and they executed the game plan. I thought our possession was very good. And then, I mean, our team is our team. I mean, Will Bruin is opt opportunistic, the first goal. The second goal, Christian does a little bit of extra, wins the ball, slips, you know, Victor, Victor, good ball, quality ball to Bruin again. And then Steph has to come up with that unbelievable save. If that's not save of the month or year, I mean, and we, and, and we get the result. How, how tough is Will Bruin? He's a tough kid. He comes up with two goals. He's obviously in a little bit he's, of pain. He's got, he's got a tight calf, but we, we, you know, we're trying to manage guys for two games. So, you know, we're trying to get guys rest when we can. Speaking of the game plan, can you talk about how uh, it's too bad you gave up a goal before halftime because Nico and Victor had a lot of success in that first half. Yeah, they were good. I thought, I thought the balance of us trying to be direct and get in on goal versus possession was good. You know, but, you know, in games like that, you got to make the t opponent pay when you, when you have the momentum. MLS is such a hard league that, you know, you got to make teams pay when you got the momentum. Big picture, despite your success you've had here in the past, how big is this for where you are right now in the standings, these three points on the road? Well, we're going to enjoy this moment first. And then I'll look at the standings tomorrow because I'm sure we crept up a little bit, but we still have a long ways to go. You did creep up. You go over Colorado and by goal differential, and then you've set yourself up for this week. So what are the challenges in three and eight as you play New England on Saturday? It's just the two games and travel. Two games and two days, or three days and travel. That's a challenge. We'll, we'll get them ready. They're, 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 They've been in good spirits. They've never quit this year, even though they've had some tough times. They haven't quit, so we won't quit there in New England either. Is it obvious that the more games that Nico and Victor play together, amongst others, but Victor especially, he just added so much tonight? Well, he's getting back to full fitness. Remember, he, he didn't start off the year fully fit, so now that he's got some games under his belt, he's getting fitter and fitter, and that, that's, that's what you see on the field. Was this good? For you also, was this win good for the coaching staff also? <laughs> I'm so proud of the players' effort because they never quit. And the team followed the game plan, so all credit to them. They worked hard tonight, and they deserve the three points.